It's fun to get your hands dirty and try something new. Working with clay lets you find out how to actually turn a mound into a masterpiece. Artist Angelica Sandoval of Studio A showed me how it takes a lot more than arm strength to create from clay. How do we get started and trying to stay clean the entire time? Yeah. Um, so basically we're going to start off with a wedged ball of clay and you want to slam it down into the center of okay. the wheel here. Like oh so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. Not you in the center, but we can move it forward. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay. And then just start kind of working. Yeah, so basically you're going to pat down on the edges. So we're going to sp start with the sponge, and you want to cone up your clay. And you're kind of using a lot of arm muscle here. Yeah, you, yeah, you want to. You're going to use the fatty parts of your hands, and you're going to press in and move the clay up. Okay, how does this look so far? It looks good, actually. Um, so just keep coning up, and you're gonna move the palms of your hands in, and you're moving the clay in. We're just centering right now, so we're just telling all the clay to go into the center. Okay. So you just kinda cone in or collar in, so you just cup your hand around. Mine's already kinda coned up. I'm gonna go ahead and push it down into a little hockey puck. And again, it's a lot of force. So if you notice, I'm like leaning over, pressing. Okay, and what do you do when you start noticing, like mine, for instance, doesn't look the way it should? So with yours, you want to kind of come in and you're going to move the clay up and it's going to want to flare out like how it is already. So you're going to use your other hand and try to control it. So I'm just, I just need to go in. for a circular shape. Yes. We'll see how much luck I'll have at making a hockey puck. <laughs> So right now, I am making the opening of a cup. So with this one, you go really slow. And your, your hand is in the inside. And then on the outside, you're just going to use your sponge, but you're going to grab some clay and move it up slowly. So this part could get really messy. It could. It could get off whack very easily, so. And how did you make it wider? Um, so my hand inside was kind of slightly pushing out, then I moved up along, followed with my hands on the outside. Is this like the right shape? Yep. And then what can I do from here? So if we're done, you want to grab your wire tool. I got it wet a little bit, slide it through, and cut the clay. Nice and tight at the bottom. There you okay. go, perfect. So I'll grab a board for you and we can set it on a board to dry out. Well, you can see as that project progressed, my confidence level went down slightly, but now step one's done and next we're going to actually add a handle to our cup. 